She'll be alright. It's nothing serious. It's just a flesh wound. Grow up. Fuck off. You never seen the life of Brian? Yes, I have. But how the fuck is that relevant? The Black Knight. Are you actually capable of making references to the real fucking world? Like, reality? Says Kanto is quoting fucking Oscar Wilde. Trust you to subscribe to the ideas of some perfume ponce. What were you thinking? You could have killed her. It was just a scratch. I'm not a mad dog. No, dogs have a sense of loyalty. Fuck off. Up until now, this has been a joke to you, Lacemaker. But if you strike out one more time, you can say goodbye to everyone here because you'll be coming back to the settlement with me. And we know how much you hate train stations. And trains. You're on thin ice, Lacemaker. How dare you talk to me like that? How dare you treat me such? How fucking dare you put me in the same pile as your doltish followers? I've been in your corner from the beginning. I was watching your back while you were still sucking your fucking thumb. Lucy. I was your friend. Your first friend. Now you want to condemn me for acting like a Kivawakian? You want to lynch me for my nature? I'm not mad. You are. Lucy. I understand. No, you don't understand. You can't understand. Quinn? How many twats do I have to deal with today? Lucy? Oh, God. Please, just don't hurt me, okay? Calm down, Leonard. The fuck quit. I've done enough hurting today. Are, are you in trouble, Lucy? Shut the fuck up, you prancing shit! I, I'm sorry. Why are you here? Oh, I have a message for, for, for Ludwig. Let's hear it then. Ugh. I'm trying to get away from you! Well, you can't. We'll talk later. You'll talk at me later, you mean? Bloody hell, Lucy. Why do you always have to do this? I'm sorry, but am I interrupting something? No. Yes! You're right, Quinn. For fuck's sake. Hello, Sullivan. What's the message? It, uh, it got out. What? AIDS? Porky the pig? Her fucking sexual preference? Well, that's no secret, love. Hand me your cellular device. <laughs> it's called an iPhone. Now it's a fucked phone. Do not answer any calls, emails, texts, or even letters, unless I say otherwise. What got out? Yeah, Danny girl, how are you doing? Now, where are you, Mike? Oh, it's a creepy fucking road, mate. Creepy what fucking road. road. You had Mike. Oh no, it's like a creepy fucking crime man can get stabbed or something. <laughs> something Danica, like that. I can't pick you up. I need the road. That's fucking great. Oh, I'm on Coronation Street, mate. Coronation Street. I think it's B1 by Ford or something. <laughs> can I come find you? That that'd be great. Rip out your chronicles. Well, that's not choosy, mate, so I don't know why you'd do that. Just, oh, okay, just, cool, cool. Just, just relax, relax. <laughs> okay, oh, no, that's my God. I'm gonna be there soon, look after you. That's good, that's good. It's a bit fucking creepy, mate, but... I think, I think I've got your scent. I've got your scent. There you are, there, 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 there. It's me. What the 
fuck do you mean it's me? What? <laughs> well, who the fuck's me? <laughs> Grandvoice Ludwig has requested your attention at the Croft Estate. Well, this can't be good.